Welcome to a Capital Moment. My name is Douglas Ike, and I am standing in front of the statue of Frederick Douglass. Frederick Douglass is the first African American to have a full statue on display here in the Capitol building. Although he began life as a slave, Frederick Douglass became a respected author, a powerful orator, and an advisor to presidents. He was one of the first African Americans to gain international fame for his intellect and leadership abilities. Born in 1818 to an enslaved mother and an unidentified white father in Talbot County, Maryland, he was first named Frederick Augustus Washington Bailey. In the first two decades of his life, he was given lint or hired out to various masters, but he also learned to read and write. Reading books and newspapers gave him a new perspective on slavery that was doubtlessly reinforced by his time with an especially brutal slave breaker. He dedicated himself to becoming a free man and in 1838 he managed to escape to New York. During the Civil War, Douglas was a recruiter for the 1st African American Army Regiment, which two of his sons joined. He met twice with President Lincoln, first about the pay and treatment of black soldiers, and then to discuss the president's desire to assist escaping slaves. What inspires me most about Frederick Douglass is his courage and willingness to fight for what he believed in. His persistence in working to end slavery will always be remembered. For more information about the artwork of the Capitol or to book a tour, go to visitthecapital.gov.